In this lecture, we will understand how to create a new blank document. Okay, so for this, you have to just click new, a file new, okay, and it will show you a pop up just like this the new document pop up. And here, okay, it will take some time, and you see. So it is showing you some of the recent items that you just created and if you don't create the anyone then it will show you the custom uh, template designs okay so just like the this one is the 512 pixel height and width and 300 ppi you see here 512 and one when, when i click on this one it is selected this one the 1890 pixels width and 1540 height and the orientation is this the landscape so you can do it also in the portrait okay so it will just uh, make it the interchange all right so just like this and click on the portrait so it will just interchange it okay and this is the resolution uh, and the resolution is just like the pixels per inch uh, that means the in one inch of area how many pixels you are using so basically uh, the 300 is good when you are doing the designing just like designing the mobile applications the mobile icons okay and the web ui and if you want to print something okay uh, just like if you are uh, designing the brochures and any business cards so you can use the 300 ppi uh, because that will uh, comes in the, the more pixel when you zoom in it will never show you the uh, pixels okay so uh, in the type of printing and all the things we will use this 300 pixels per inch okay and this is the color mode okay so you can use the grayscale color mode okay it will uh, show you the black and white just like the grayscale and for the rgb the rgb is red green blue okay and the cmyk it is the uh seven um, magenta yellow and case for black and this mode is used when we do the printing okay if you are uh, designing up just like the template that you want to print then you can use the 300 pixels per inch and cmyk mode okay and 8 bit is sufficient you can also use the 16 bit for more color just like it's the 2 key power uh, just like uh, the power of 2 okay 8 is the power of 2 so you can multiply the 2 the 8 times and that much color it will show and for 16 it will multiply to the 16 times okay and that much colors we will have in this type of color mode okay so basically the, and this is the uh, background content just like the background you want the black uh, the less like the white black and any color that you want okay and the advanced options but we don't need the any advanced option because this is just like the uh, square pixels expect ratios okay you can define this also no uh, so basically this is the setting that you want to change according to your what type of work all right so this is the recent the saved one okay mobile web for web it will show you the automatic uh, template so uh, it's like this if you want to design use this one the for uh, web labs you can use this one and for the mobile it will show you the just like the iphone 6 which is the standard size of the iphone 6 screen okay so it will show you the uh, template according to this one you can just click on the phone size okay the mobile design and you can define your custom using this one just like if i want to increase this to 768 then i can increase it using this one okay and all these things come into the pixels must remember okay and if you are designing the business card the brochures then you can use the inches in that case okay but basically we will uh, the most of the time we will work in the pixels so let's just create it and you see here a blank artboard okay where you gonna design it and this is the type of the group Okay, and you can make it just uh, cut out from this one. Okay, you can just do here the ungroup artboard and you have your layer. The blank layer and you can just paste a white color here. 
okay select this paint bucket tool and white color here now you have your blank layer so just like this you can create a new blank document or if you want to create one then you can just press ctrl n okay so you see the same one and you can okay, uncheck this artboard and create and it will create me a second or uh, the new blank layer so for this you can create a, as multiple as you want to create 